Hello everyone, it's Ella Rose here. I have to share this with you. I have been very quiet. I didn't want to come into anything like this. I don't normally get into political stuff, but I have to share this. Okay, let's take our planet back. The United Nations New World Order Project is a global high-level initiative founded in 2008 and led by James Lillian, Julian and Napta Manda, Mandela to advance a new economic paradigm, a new world order for humankind which achieves the UN goals, global goals for sustainable development by 2030 and the happiness, well-being and freedom for all life by 2050. Initiatives, so capitalism. Capitalism is a new economic paradigm which places happiness, well-being and freedom at the centre of all human development models, systems and all life. The United Nations International Day of Happiness, UNIDO, founded in 2012, happiness recognises happiness as a fundamental human right and goal and is celebrated every March 20 forever. Sustainable Development Goals, United UN Goals, Global goals advancing a new economic paradigm of capitalism for humanity remains mobilizing 30 trillion toward achieving the 17 UN goals, 169 targets by to join us. And then advancing a new economic paradigm of capitalism since 2008. A great revolution is waiting for us. The crisis doesn't only make us free to imagine other models another future, another world, it obliges, to, obliges us to. So, that was in 2008, French President Nicolas Sarkozy, making an impact across the globe, 10 billion happy by 2050, every March since 2012, all 7.8 fellow members of the global human family living in 206 countries and territories celebrate happiness as a fundamental human right and a goal. Capitalism is a new economic paradigm for human humanity. What the heck? Yeah, okay. So, I found this a little bit weird. So on the other page, at 160 here, 16 goals in 2015 was agreed to 17 global goals, known as the SISTOLS or SDS. Goals have the power to create a better world by turning poverty, fighting inequality in the environment. Guided by the goals, it's now up to all governments, business, and civil society public to work together to build a better future for everyone. One, two, zero hunger, be good health and well being, four, quality education, quality. Six clean water and sand. Ten reduce inequalities. Eleven livable cities in production. Climate action. Fourteen life below water. In peace and strong institutions. Actions. Thirteen and partners.